I'm Dr. Jason Adaman. I'm double board certified in the specialty of physical medicine and rehabilitation and the subspecialty of pain medicine and interventional pain management. Oftentimes I see patients that come to me that have been told repeatedly by multiple doctors that they just have to live with their pain, that there's nothing else that can be done, but in reality the issue is that they have not had the resources for the proper treatment. The doctors that I had had experience with, a lot of them, um, their only solution for me was to medicate me and um, I actually had one doctor tell me that oh, I can't fix you, all I can do is just prescribe um, pain medication for you. And I'm still young and I want to live my life and not be on medication forever. So um, it was exciting to come to Dr. Adam and, and learn from the very first appointment that his goal was to get rid of the pain and to get rid of the medicine as well. Um, so that I I could go on living my life free of all of that. The most important thing I can offer a patient is hope. Most of the people that come to see me have suffered for years with their pain, sometimes decades, and they have been repeatedly told that there's nothing left to be done, that they have to live with their pain, or even that they're imagining their pain. 99% of the time there are treatments available for people with chronic pain that have never been offered to them, and I pride myself on finding those options for the patient. I really want them to leave the office with a sense of hope. One of the things I strive for is to be able to give patients the whole continuum of treatment options for their pain. And that's what differentiates me and, and my clinic from, from other locations or other physicians. When I came to see Dr. Adaman, he definitely gave me uh, treatment choices that I had not previously been offered. That is my role as a specialist, is to understand these nuances and try to come up with a different angle to treating the patient. When patients come to me for the first time for an initial consultation, I do a very thorough review of their past medical treatments, their imaging reports, any studies they've had done, notes from the previous physicians, and I try to take a very comprehensive uh, history from the patient. I need to understand how my patient is suffering because people perceive pain in different fashions. It affects their lives differently. He's always kind. The entire staff is amazing, and I'm really, I feel like now they're my second family. We treat patients with what's called a multidisciplinary approach, which means I, as the physician, will diagnose and order specific treatments for the patient for the best outcome, and that is variable, but it can include pain psychology, where we work with PhD-level psychologists who specialize in, in pain, physical therapists who help uh, re-educate the patient with range of motion, uh, injections which help reduce pain, manipulation uh, which sometimes works uh, sufficiently on its own or needs a team approach. He was willing to try more advanced treatments um, that definitely weren't offered to me by other doctors and by doing those procedures um, I was able to get rid of my pain. The bottom line is that we tailor the approach and the treatment plan for the specific patient. So when a patient comes to me, I don't see them as a herniated disc. I don't see them as an amputee. I see them as a person uh, experiencing and suffering from a certain type of pathology and each person requires individualized treatment. Before I started seeing Dr. Adaman, my pain level was between 8 and 9 on a scale of 10. And I was not able to physically do normal daily activities. And after coming to Dr. Adaman, my pain now is um, about 95% gone. One of the greatest things in my life has been to see patients that have been incapacitated by their pain get back to their life, even if it's not in full, even if it's some sort, small aspect of their life that they had lost. And oftentimes we have patients that have even more dramatic recovery, climbing to the top of mountains or, or getting out of wheelchairs. When I was experiencing pain, um, I was not able to do normal uh, daily functions such as unloading the dishwasher, going up and down the stairs in my home. Now to go from feeling like I have no life and no hope and that I was just, this, is, this was what it was gonna be, to being able to do things like, I, I never thought I would be excited about unloading the dishwasher or doing laundry or going up and down the stairs, but um, it's been amazing to have my life back. I really enjoy my profession because I get to allow patients 
to enjoy their life better. I'm a quality of life physician. I don't necessarily save lives too often, but I save quality of lives. And that brings me a lot of personal satisfaction.